Hey, how are you guys doing today? Uh, I hope you guys are kicking some butt. So we're back with some Dungeons and Dragons online. Uh, like many of the games, of course, it's free to play with the ability to spend a bunch of extra money on microtransactions and expansions. So we've got 400 experience and a greater heroism potion for the day. Looks like we did not necessarily unload. What we got here. Oh, so this this could be seriously a good thing. This ghost pain right here. You look over this crap right here. Difference in. Okay, that blue shine we want to keep for sure. Mm, I don't know. Honestly, at this point, I need to do enough missions that we get a uh, bag of holding. And so I'm trying to think of which uh, free people, you know, the, uh, what you call it, the Freeport Society. Let's look at what faction it is, guys, actually. Free agents. That's what we need is free agent missions. Because I need another inventory slot badly. And so let's look what we can find. Free agent style for missing missions that we don't have farmed points from. That might be a good idea, right? Jeez, they've got a bunch. And obviously gatekeeper missions we're sucking on, right? Oh, guys. So wiping the signet. I legit don't know if we can do swiping the signet because that's like a rogue one. And uh, my opinion is that that will fail badly because we're a barbarian and definitely not roguey in any capacity. And so that's a bad one. Um, where's this? Three Barrel Cove. Guys, I'm going to be honest. I'm not sure if I even own Three Barrel Cove as a uh, adventure. That's the necropolis. Oh, guys. Well, that's definitely not the right thing either. Let's see, do we have a the storm reach? There's the ruins of Thrall. Shrouded Valley. Tanglefoot Gorge. So it's not in this one. Let's let's hit the necropolis real quick for one second. I'm gonna let you know this this guy is not set up to do the necropolis well. Um, mostly because literally uh, the one temple of plagues. If you're not a specific type of paladin, you basically are just gonna get your butt kicked. And I'm just realistically that's the truth. Um, the, I have the Paladin build that's set up for doing it. Um, I don't play it currently. Because, in all honesty, oh, we got a whole bunch of content was below its level. But at this point, this guy's caught up to it almost. So let's grab this first uh, group of Necropolis missions right here. Now, there are some that I will not be able to do because you have to have more than one person to do some of the necropolis missions and that's the bummer about some of this i mean if you guys ever did have one of these missions that you needed to do you wanted to set it up for when we're playing this i would do that to help you and me get through it now um some necropolis missions realistically just are easier to do for certain classes like, my rogue in the Necropolis is kind of good. There's actually one that you need a rogue for. I can't remember which mission it is. And so I've done it with people. But, uh, legitimately, uh, these missions are set up much more for undead slaying dudes and stuff. And which, by the way, if you're uh, the right kind of undead slayer, that's awesome. There's some undead in these. And obviously a ton of missions. I think I still haven't unlocked the final Necropolis, um, Necropolis 4. And so there's probably one, 
mission set that I'm still missing even. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, let's see. There's the spirit binder. We're gonna spirit bind right here. Okay, real quick, I'm gonna talk to the barkeep just to make sure that there isn't some junk that we should be getting rid of. Um, that's always a question, right? And make sure we repaired our gear, actually, a little bit. I don't use shields. I'm not gonna use that. That's ridiculous, we're keeping that. Get rid of that. Normal arrows are worthless. Free up some slots right there. Okay, and there is a map. We'll get these guys as two. Some of these necropolis missions are below us. Some of them um, are probably at our zone. Reality wise, they're really challengely well built. Challenge wise. I believe the first section of Necropolis right here, the Tomb of the Tornado, Mented, the Shadow Knight, and stuff like that. I do believe we can do with them all. There's probably a first one you're supposed to do first out of it. I have no idea. Let's go up here. Right here. Let's do the Tomb of the Shadow Guard first, right? Eighth level. Oh, is that not horribly? Within reason. I'm going to summon our dude. By the way, I do hope you guys are having a great weekend. I've had a great weekend. So, okay. Oh, they're all spell casting dudes. Oh, I hate spell casting dudes. The tomb Tam looking floor down here. has fallen away here, revealing a flooded cave. Crapola, guys. This is a bunch of swimmy crap. Uh, I did this on my rogue. Honestly, this guy's in heavy armor, so it's going to be different, but he has tons and tons of. Uh, Endurance, so his swim ability compared to a lot is pretty good. But even this guy is, is starting to have holy crap, right? Guys, that's some serious crap. We'll start dying in a second. So, if we weren't a beast, we'd be in some real trouble. Oh, that's still flooded. Holy crap, guys. Whoo! Way too close. Okay, so let's pay more attention to the map thing up there. This, this I'm not thinking is a friendly dungeon, right? I did this on my dun my uh, little rogue a long time ago, but I'm pretty sure he has like a water breathing ring, maybe, maybe not. Let's see what this guy has, right? Do we have some water breathing stuff if I had to use it? Hold on one second, we're gonna make sure that we don't have something just in case. No, that's that's sucky. I have potions of water breathing. I'm not religious. I'm never gonna use that skill. That defensive fighting, pff, not gonna happen. I'm gonna look around at what we're trying to do here.
Why would the henchman just stand in there? I can't do anything about it. We found it though. Is this a worthless room? Is this not worth crap either? Oh man. So we found an alcove that does f nothing for us. Is what we found, guys. Okay, so watch this. I'm gonna tell you, this would not be cool. This, I mean like, got, yeah, we got magic potions and stuff. But in reality, this, this would be some bullcrap situation. There's zero chance I would make this swim. Like this is, this is way far underwater to swim. Can you imagine that? You'd be the confidence level you need to even, so this the is, moss uh, here is releasing moss. Small bubbles you can, of air. Get this. Perhaps it can make the swim a little easier. It could. It could definitely do that. This is some doom stuff, though. Do we need to be going back the other way? No. Yeah, this is this is definitely one of those situations that would not be cool. Okay, so there's a pocket. Are we just in a pocket? Did that what we accomplished here? I'm sorry if I just took us the wrong way, because I'm pretty sure I did. The tomb's guardian lies just beyond those bars. From okay, all the so rubble, let's get as much like of the outline thing. Yeah, I get it. I swam the wrong way. We're good. Good thing I have multiple of those potions. Let's let's hit another one. Try to get through multiple rooms before we run out of okay there is only one direction here <coughs> yeah I wasn't sure if we needed to go further down, maybe. Hold on, guys. Okay, so that's the way we need to go. Into this room. This is the water we need to go into. I'm gonna drink some 
we know we can make it this this distance because we're a beast and then on top of that we're gonna barbarian rage ourselves which is gonna give us some plus to constitution and, and strength so our swims gonna be beast style swimming Oh yeah, we're starting to get this somewhere. I'm gonna be honest, dungeons that are underwater Seriously dangerous. We're still on the right track. How do, how does it seem like we're off track? What is this red glowy crap in the water? I'm not sure we're in the right room, guys. I don't, I'm not sure where we are. This this seems like a uh, some kind of underwater labyrinth thing. This, this might be a challenge. Because we've got to find and slay two dudes. Okay, we found one of them. Very good. The next one is Tiernan. Be on your guard. You know what? We're going to use this chaos hammer this time. And I'm going to drop it into the sneak position because we know we're not really ever going to sneak. Then I'm going to switch those two out. And then we're going to switch to this. Let's see how that works out for us. Wait, is this not a, a two-handed one? Is this a one-handed weapon? What the crap is this crap? Oh, this is just a warhammer, guys. We could have used a shell with this warhammer stuff. We're a two-handed weapon fighter, though. We're gonna go with this just because. Okay, I'm gonna get rid of that. And that. Sorry. Whatever happened to this tomb did a <sighs> massive amount of damage. One wrong step and the entire place feels like it would come crashing down. We all know. We all know. Okay, let's see. I don't know, maybe those are glowy fish. Are there two directions that they're trying to take us? One is up here. And what is down there? Is that what I'm seeing? Crap on them if that's what's going on. This guy's a super tough barbarian to be making this kind of swim, though. I really mad respect on that. Boom. Yeah, no, nah, I would not not make this kind of swim. This would be this. I'd be dead back there in that cave somewhere, honestly. Not even gonna pretend. Super humanly good swim right there. I know that there's people in those countries where they do a lot of that uh, diving and stuff. Not the same. But... Let's switch to this actually.
Okay, well that's not that impressive of treasure. We're not happy with that, but it's okay. Okay, I'm gonna make it over here before we jump down there. There's some kind of ghost somewhere. Well, face spiders don't make that sound. I don't know what's going on there. Okay. I'm gonna use a... Yeah, can you imagine confidently diving down this crap? Nah. This would be a big red flag. Wait, let me see where I'm going. Further down. That's kind of cool, actually. These dungeons are just done so well. But this is, this is ridiculous. This is on the edge. I like wizards with... Uh, spells to not have to worry about it. That's one thing. We're not a wizard. How's it back? Seriously, it's crap. This is one heck of a deadly swim, guys. This be lethal as crap. Look at this. Yeah, this is this is only made possible by magic. Seriously? Nope, that's a pocket. Okay, we're on our own breath. Ooh. Everybody else's confidence levels going down also? Is this just a trick? No. Go up. Make it, guys. But, but this, oh, look, there's some plant. No, nah, that's the wrong kind of plant. That's not the kind that makes it where we can drink or breathe underwater. We need the whatever it is called moss. Are you serious, guys? This is ridiculous. So I've got a bunch of healing potions that we're just downing to keep us... Ah, uh, there, there we are. Holy crap, that was getting super dangerous. Whoa. Were they serious about trying to kill a dude there? 
Yeah. It's when you you do need a party in this kind of this this is the kind of dungeon that a party would be nice in. An invisible stalker. <laughs> Those cold arrows could be good. The ones we're needing is we're needing some sonic arrows, and in all honesty, I should just buy some out of the auction house. Because uh, without a sonic weapon, we can't. Uh, what are we looking at here? We came up out of that, right? Yeah. Are you freaking serious? Was this a pointless direction to go? Oh man. I'm not trying to have a bad attitude about that. But that was a super deadly swim for it to be a side trip. Oh, well, let's double check. I don't want to be back and swim in this. search just in case I don't I don't know but I would consider this not a good situation I was hoping that was some kind of hey you step on it Legitimately, this is the kind of dungeon that I do dread, though. Okay, watch for the oxygen bubble thing for sure. We need to find these every time for safety reasons and such.
Yeah, this is some ridiculous swimming. And they don't have that moss all over. I think this is the right way this time. Maybe, I don't know. Very hard to tell, huh? So no crap, this is the kind of dungeon that somebody should dread. Are you serious? Is this just a... Good thing, because I almost went back. and decide if I think this is a new direction. I hope so, right? That's freaking hot coffee, guys. Like, super hot. Let's go. Cross your fingers. Hope. Yeah, we're in new water. Ready? I'm gonna drink a thing. Take a haste potion. Do you think it curves around and goes that way that we're needing? Crap, we screwed up on the uh, breathing. Watch for it to off tunnel to the side, and we're just going to keep ourselves alive with a bunch of potions if need be. some moss I'm gonna be honest that's we might be in a new section is this a section this way and then is this a separate section this way on their their mapping no, that's the way I came This is exactly the kind of dungeon that does actually make this game an extraordinarily good challenge. What the crap? Are we? Oh, not good. Look at this. Look. Absolutely, we've we've spun ourselves around, guys. 
Absolutely. I want to make sure there's no other water pool accessible some other direction that we might <sighs> holy crap you guys we've got down and straight forward has to be somewhere to go down here, right? No. It's hard to tell where you're going in here, too. I be wrong if we need to go this other way. Back here. Then you've got down here, right? Down here goes nowhere. That goes nowhere. We'll make it, we'll be fine. This is just gonna have us close to death, probably. Fine. Okay, you know, I really, really wish we could drop something and mark the ones we just came from to d just make dang sure we didn't get mixed around or flipped around. And honestly, I don't know how much flipping around this is involved inside this cave. And so... Okay, so there's the spiders we killed. Let's make sure there's nothing over here. Okay. Let's do this with a plan. Are these two different directions? Is this a different water pool? I think we just solved something. So this water pool is a different one. I'm not sure if we've done this one or the other one. Let's hope to God this is a new one. I want to make sure every step of the way that we're going there. Our direction that's good. See, it, so much of it goes under already existing stuff that legitimately uh, isn't good. Come on. Let's make 
quite sure. Look at this. They're hooking us up right there. Okay, but we already did this one and found out it doesn't do what we wanted it to. So we do want to go the other way, I'll bet. Okay, well, let's finish this out. Make sure, sure. I thought this was ridiculous, to be honest, I think. Eventually, I guess we'll have this memorized. My hater says a little bit. Eventually, right? But I, I think it was that other direction anyway, to be honest, guys. They did not mess around on this though at all. I just want to make sure that, that that is the same. I'm pinning him so he doesn't move. Yeah, so this was just that chamber that had that other dude in it. Crap, Ola. This is, this is serious dungeon, you guys. Okay, so we're gonna hop over the other side this next time. And hope that that gets us on the right path. Seriously, because this stuff only regenerates every little while. So that's not even... Are usable. This is, this is a bad situation. Right, everybody agrees? 
don't do that. Don't, don't jump to this thing. I'm watching our life, by the way. There. Oh my gosh. There's a definitely be a, hey, this kills a lot of people per year cave. Okay, hold on, let me compose myself. Okay. I'm going to now summon our cleric, because we know we're going this way now. And I'm gonna have him zap me. Which, this is definitely a new area. So this is encouraging you guys. Summon our dude. But we cannot accidentally go down the wrong side. I'm gonna be honest. Not really super happy about this crap. Okay, so this is this is very promising, right? This is such a serious dungeon. Oh, 
they've got me. <coughs> bleeding. Okay, I'm gonna have to wait till we quit bleeding. <coughs> Oh, if that was a returning Edmantium plus uh, two throwing axe, that would be a little better, but we'll take it, whatever, right? At this point, the fact that we're we're slowly actually getting somewhere is kind of nice. I want to make sure I get this room mapped out before we jump in the water. Because it looks like we're actually making some profit progress at this point, you know. Oh, holy Oh, it's going to be super long. You know, if you were a scuba diver exploring some place like this, it'd be super cool. Oh. Well, now I'm wondering this thing goes. keep on giving us new dudes every time we kill anybody and I'm not trying to be a, a, a jerk <laughs> definitely looks like we're in route to the right direction though direction. Yep.
jump power. We could use these actually right now, despite the fact they're on the other side. I'm not gonna though. So it's obvious that this is where they're wanting us to go at this point, right? Okay, definitely summoning him. We're getting closer and closer to that inner area. In fact, we're in the inner area. <laughs> tell you guys this is immediately not my favorite game. this is definitely also not the dungeon to get lost in Alright, this is legit. Okay, so that was a little extreme. I, I don't know if I really liked that dungeon as much as some of the others, but uh, pretty good dungeon, honestly. I just didn't like the the holy crap's threat to swim in part. Maybe if I would have thought about it, brought a uh, water breathing item, item like a permanent item of water breathing with us, it would have been a different situation, honestly. And so that was the Tomb of the Shadowy Guard in the Necropolis. So, um, I'm still trying to get my exact schedule down to where it's more conducive to streaming stuff and uh, having an actual balanced life. So next week when we come back, I'm going to knock out the rest of this Necropolis area stuff. I do want to thank you. Well, I'll knock out some more missions from the Necropolis area. And so we'll hang out in the Necropolis for a while knocking out missions we can't do all of them without a legit party i'm going to just be honest with you guys 
And so, um, maybe I'll get a hold of a couple buddies, see if they're willing to log in, just specifically to knock out some of the ones that you can't do with, um, out some other people. But, all the ones we can do, we'll knock out in this area over the next couple weeks. I want to thank you guys for hanging out with me. Peace, very best wishes, and I hope you have a great day.